Alright, this is a little side mission in a little town called Canarac. That's how you pronounce it. Whatever. It's a friggin' fantasy game. A lot of weird names. It's called A Tangled Web. I'm only a few hours into the game, and I read about this. Some people want to know if you can get a house because uh, resource management is a big problem with this game and it's one of the reasons why a few times I just stopped playing it because you can't carry anything you have to get these stupid backpacks which cost a lot but anyway when you get in this town it's all about spiders you kill a few spiders once you get into the town this dude named Gardner which you see right here yeah 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 he basically wants you to um, help him out and um, and kill this other guy that was sent off into some weird cave or something to do something. This guy named Barton. And I guess Gardner wants to take over the town. I don't know, it's kind of a flaky mission. It doesn't really matter. You can do it in like five minutes. The main thing is, you know, you got to do what I'm saying. <laughs> Once you get into the cave here, um, a, a few of these, a lot of this, I, I think I just run a lot past a lot of the spiders because I was trying to film very fast here, you know. Yeah, that's my lady, Sharifra. <laughs> I love how you can just make up names, Sharifra. There's really no, there's no other enemies in this whole oh, cave except for spiders, and I'm only at like, as you can see, I'm only at like level three. I got a little shield around me. That always helps, even though it takes away some of your your mana, magic, whatever the crap you want to call it. And I am wearing the uh, Mass Effect outfit, as you can see. That's if you, you there's a code that comes with a game, or if you had Mass Effect, I think I guess Mass Effect 2 um, demo, then you, you get this, and your health regenerates if you wear this outfit. And it's in the very first town you get into, and I'm I think I'm sure. I've already played through a huge amount of this game before, and after a while, this even though your health will regenerate wearing this outfit, uh, you run, run across different armor that just seems better, you know. Although in this beginning stages, it's, it's pretty fun to have this to have this armor. I don't think bad about having that stupid globe around you it, it's kind of discerning and it kind of de detracts from what you're doing it's got this little bubble around you but it is a nice little shield I don't even know why I'm wearing it here I don't need it spiders are not a big deal yeah I don't I don't understand the game how it uh it, it, it gives you all this loot but you're not able to do anything with it um, and you can only get these backpacks that are sold by merchants in several of the town. I think there's four or five backpacks you can get and I was gonna buy one in one of the first towns but it was like seven thousand dollars and I only had about three. I was like damn it. <laughs> so I figured I'd go ahead and do this mission real quick. Kill these motherfuckers. Kill, kill. Why is it in every RPG game there's always spiders in caves? Always. Lord of the Rings kind of thing. Although well, pretty creepy in this. Pretty creepy. I'm like, uh, where do I go now? I'm like, I am a dumbass. <laughs> Come on, Sharitha. 
with your Mass Effect suit on. There's my guy. Ah, oh, he's already fighting spiders. Better go help him. I think when you do go into this mode, it is pretty cool. Pretty good cinematics. That blows out my surround sound speakers, too. So there's a few things you can do here. You can, you know, save. You can talk to this guy and save him, or you can kill him. And it's kind of up to you what you want to do. And a lot of people might not know that. Uh, if you want to be a good person, you probably just gonna want to go ahead and save him. Even though that guy Gardner wanted you to come in here and kill him. I think even if I didn't know about the house, I probably would have saved the guy anyway. Because we're a little suspicious about that guy saying, "Well, go assassinate the guy, this guy," you know. And you're like, "Well, why do you want me to kill him?" The voice acting, it's okay, I guess. What I don't like is that my character's not talking. She's just standing there. And it's really stupid. She's like, I am a mute. It's, I hate it when they do that with, with a lot of these RPG games. <laughs> it's a good thing I warped back to the town through my video edit editing because... <laughs> It took me forever to get out of that cave. I got lost. My god, that stupid level up. Yes, I know I need to level up. I want to listen to what the guy's saying. What's cool is, now that you've saved this guy, uh, he's going to give you a house. And he's going to give you some more quests to do. So it's a very win-win situation. Like Charlie Sheen would say, winning! I think the only thing you get if you kill him in that cave with them spiders is only $700 gold. So it's not really worth it. You need that. You, you need the dang house to put, your, put, to put all your crazy loot into. Since you can't carry much of anything, the game starts you off at only like, what is it, 70, 70 items or something? That's it? That's like the cap on it? And each backpack gives you like 10 or something? It's really lame. So it's not done by weight, it's done by item. I mean, Skyrim gets occasionally cumbersome, but it's a lot better than this. Skyrim does a lot of things better than this. But this is a, this is an interesting little game. I've never beat it. I'm gonna might try to actually beat it now. But here's your house in Canarock, Canarac, whatever you call. It. There's nothing to it. But what's cool is that I forgot about this. Look at see the mirror over there. You can actually change your appearance. That is cool, man. So I could actually chop off all her head and give her a mohawk or tattoos or whatever. You can go to sleep there. But the main thing is that dang chest over in the corner where you can put all your loot and crap that you can come back to later. Alright, man. Thanks for, for watching this insane video. It's been so exciting. Alright. Later.